Greetings, everyone. This is First in 2073 with the next episode of Geopolitical Simulator 4 Power and Revolution. And we are going into. We have about, I think, six days left before this air base here is built. There you go. And that means it is about time to start making some moves against Lebanon. Lebanon is going to be the target of the next military intervention. Uh, before I do that, um, real quick look at the economy. Uh, things are going well. Um, the growth rate has come back. Unemployment is now down below two, and inflation inflation is dipping. So again, uh, non-intervention strategies in the economy. No need to boost it uh, in the first quarter. I still want to uh, bring down inflation a little bit more. Uh, so I am going to go ahead and raise the minimum wage again. And hopefully that'll give me a nice popularity boost going into the. Uh, Establishment minimum wage. We're going to bump that up. There you go. Uh, Ten more dollars. Uh, hopefully that'll bump me up into the 80s or something like that. Uh, there's another thing I could do. I could probably increase research. I'm going to try to bump up minimum wage right now. We're going to try to give this a quick bump. It will pass. Our left is uh, in favor. And people should be in favor of it. 77% should pass Parliament. Let's go ahead and pass that. Uh, since the economy is making a comeback, we're going to increase minimum wage again and try and attempts to uh, drive down this inflation. That's our goal there. Okay, so uh, that's the last economic thing we're going to do for a while. Now it is time for military intervention. We are going to provide proof that a nation is a threat to international security. That proof is going to be Lebanon. Lebanon is the. There we go, Lebanon. All right, we have proof that they have been financing terrorist organizations, and it is now time to reveal it to the world. And here we go. There it is. All right, Greek Tribune, Greece, UN Tribune, Greece announces, accuses we Lebanon. Have irrefutable evidence that this country is violating international conventions. Mm. This evidence should lead you to consider thoughtfully. What shall we do? Mm. Should we close our eyes or should we reaffirm the rule of law? Rule of law. Good speech. Good speech. What do we got here? Evidence is sufficient for sanctions. Prime Minister, after examining your request, we admit the evidence that you brought to our attention is sufficiently strong to take concrete action against Lebanon. Sanctions are going to be imposed. Okay. That's one step, but we want military intervention. Let's see what... Let's let this... I want to see what the reaction is from the uh, minimum wage bump. Montenegro. Eliminate head of state. No, we don't want to do that yet. Well, get out of here. What's going on? Stop it. Refuse that. Cyprus, I do not want to eliminate their head of state either. Um, Business leaders are currently marching through the city relatively calmly without breaching the peace. Alright, they're complaining about minimum wage. That's fine. Let them protest. Happy to. That's what we call you, sir. Honestly, I'm not I need a good bump in the polls from oh. you. Alright, here we go. Did that go up? Uh, it just went up a little bit there. Public finances, not much. Alright, so hopefully the... Um, hopefully the endorsement will bring us up a little bit. Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, let's go to the UN. Actually, should we wait till Monday morning to do it? Let's wait till Monday morning, right? We don't want to go to war on Sunday. Monday morning, we are going to... Here we go. Alright, now, it is time to go before the UN. Monday morning. And we... Statement in the press. Nice bump. Look at that. Warmongering still. Ugh, good thing we got that statement in the press. Alright, uh, it is time to ask the UN Security Council to authorize military intervention against a country... That country is going to be Lebanon. All right. Now I can meet with people to convince them to try to vote my way, but again, I had some problems on a couple episodes ago, and I forgot which ones were good ones for me to meet. Some of them I can't meet with. Let's see here. It will hurt me internationally if I do. 
go back to... You know what? Maybe I could figure it out on this thing. Human rights. Level of democracy. Hmm. Maximum. Minimum. China. Minimum. Russia. I think we should only do yellow countries. Right? Ghana, I thought, was one that I could use. But didn't I have problems with Ghana? I can't remember. Okay, back to the political and the UN Security Council. Who can we meet with? I think I'm gonna... Yeah, they seem to be leaning towards us. Japan seems to be leaning towards us, right? Bhutan was definitely a no. I'm not gonna meet with Iran. Azerbaijan, I don't know. Let's check these guys out. Azerbaijan. Okay, so. Human rights. Zero is a perfect democracy. A hundred is a dictator. So, 23. You would think we can meet with them. So let's have a meeting with them. Try to have a meeting with them. That, that should be fine. What is the situation in Iran? That's probably bad human rights. Human rights here. Alright, 67. So, no, I'm not gonna go there. Uh, what about this guy? Can I actually fix another this guy? Moral character. See, I think I screwed up on this. Um, I was looking at higher moral care. Was I even looking at this before? I don't even remember looking at this. Um, so, moral character. He is actually has good moral character. But 67 makes him a little bit of a dictator. I'm going to stay away from this guy. Oh, another suggestion that was pretty good by Robert White, I think. Uh, look for the ones that have military uniforms. And uh, does Nigeria have military These are suits. I guess apparently some of these guys have military uniforms. And yep, yep, yep. Uh, they would definitely be dictators. This guy looks good. I think I had problems, though, when I met with them. They're producing chemical weapons. Look at that. Again, I don't want to look at that. I want to be able to find that for myself. Yuck. These guys seem to be... I mean, I would meet with Russia and China just to try to prevent them from vetoing the bill. I don't know. I think we're just going to have to wait and wait this one out. See what happens. I have information on Algeria, too. So if this falls through, we can always try Algeria. Ideological alignment. Moral character. Pretty nice. The country itself. Human rights. Seven. This is perfect. Let's meet with these guys. Uh, just to lock in a vote. Okay, let's see what happens with these two meetings. Back to the back to the map. Okay, back to the game. All right, you and Tribune in Greece is requesting authorization to take military action against Lebanon. Given the systematic violations of which this rogue state is guilty and which are unacceptable from the perspective of international law, I ask the Security Council to assume its responsibilities and authorize us to intervene militarily. Yes. We must hurry if chaos is to be avoided. Yes. Come on. Oh boy. Can we get him? Can we get him? In the meantime, is this base built yet? Not yet. Where are we at? Air Base 7. People are telling me to buy aircraft carriers too. I don't think there are any aircraft carriers available on the market. And I wouldn't have them in time anyways for this fight, but it could be good for the Syrian fights, I guess. Black market. I can buy an aircraft carrier on the black market. That's ridiculous. That seems kind of ridiculous to me. Canada! Canada has an aircraft carrier for sale. How do you like that? Rank 3. France. Ooh, okay, I guess there's two aircraft carriers on the market that we can buy. Here is our growth forecast for the end of the year based on calculations that we made last month. This is an average figure. It so the economy the is model. coming back. It looks good. 
French aircraft carrier or a Canadian aircraft carrier? Let's see here. Attack potential, 16 per fighter jet, 32 with limited range torpedoes. Defense potential is 960 with a moderate speed specific specificities. I uh, have five fighter jets at disposal. On disposal at start, possibility of 10 at the most. Oh, wait a minute, what's going on there? The work is finally over, and the inauguration will take place during the next few weeks. Would you like to attend the ceremony and cut the red ribbon? Sure, why not? Alright, 14 per jet. 14 per jet fighter missile. All right, let's see what the the big aircraft carrier looks like here. Whoa, Russia and the United States. France has probably got the cheapest one. Uh, Russia might have the cheapest one. Happiness declining Greece. Whoa, three billion dollars for an aircraft carrier over three years would be about a billion a year. Okay, that's not bad. I don't know how low I can go on this. Bid. Well, it's gonna take several days, huh? I should arrange a meeting with the French in order to get an aircraft carrier deal as well. And while I'm at it, ah, beautiful law was passed. Happiness decline, not with this new minimum wage. Bill has been voted on, and the law has been passed. Back into the 80s, baby. Prime Minister, it is undeniable that your popularity is a measure of the action of your government. Very good. Alright, so we're going to meet with France to negotiate an aircraft carrier and sway them on the Security Council. I want to meet with Russia. I have a good popularity. Let's meet with them. Okay, hold on a second. When is the vote going to happen? Should say that on the calendar, right? It's inauguration. I do not see any UN vote happening anytime soon. Let's see what we got here. Consult the composition and agenda of the Security Council. I guess uh, we're still waiting to hear from them. Whoa. Okay, refuse that. Yeah. We'll wait till the meeting. I guess I should probably also meet with the United States. That would be two aircraft carriers. Whew. But if they're about a billion a year, I actually could afford two aircraft carriers. Care for refugees. Your modern vision of feminism has Some people were saying that they think uh, everyone's sick about hearing, uh, hearing from her. Hearing her support me. Did I, I set up a meeting with the Russians? Okay. Alright. Yuck. Belarus still has that conquest of Latvia there. Alright, here's our first meeting with a UN Security Council member. Come on! And it doesn't look like I can even uh, propose anything with this guy either. How is that? This guy, moral character. Oh, wow. I didn't see that moral character on him. Obviously, not very nice guy. Okay, coffee. No thanks. My ultra can't take it. I love your country. Try that with some. Damn it. All right, let's see if we can buy anything from them. Oil. They definitely have oil. Do they have any gold? No gold. I don't remember if we need copper. Yeah, I think we need copper still. They don't have enough copper to sell us. I'll buy oil from you. Oil? That's a lot of oil. I will buy that much oil from you. Why is this... Is this a non-OPEC price oil? What is the OPEC price on oil? Holy macro. I don't remember what the OPEC price is on oil. 
Less attractive than the previous one. Um, can I get the OPEC price on oil? I don't even know where I would look for that. No. Other organizations. Non member. OPEC. Price of oil per ton is four sixty four forty six. Per barrel is sixty one. That looks like uh a really bad deal on oil from Azerbaijan. I'm not buying your oil. That's just ridiculous. Yeah, no, definitely not. What about natural gas? Steel. I think we have enough steel. Natural gas. Natural gas. I don't want to buy it all. Pretty low sales price. Let's go for five the uh, five million. And we're gonna low ball them. Alright, not bad. I probably don't have too many negotiations with these guys. That's good. I'll come up a little bit on this one. Let's see if he takes three fifty. Yes! All right, made a deal for natural gas. Okay. Uh, I can't encourage him to, you know, vote for me. What about a non-aggression pact? No. There should be more negotiations involved in this game, I think. There should be ways to negotiate different things. I would like to see that in the next edition of this game. More negotiations. End this meeting. All right. Um, more negotiation tactics. Now, since I can't convince any of them to uh, join me or to vote for me, I'm going to definitely erase that meeting. We could still buy aircraft carriers from uh, France and uh, the United States. What was going on with this guy? Moral character, 26. He's nice. So less likely for them. I don't see any military thing going on there. And human rights is a 7. Gotta be fine. There's gotta be fine with human rights. They might have gold too, because they're near South Africa. South Africa has gold. Alright, so let's, uh. We're gonna take a hit from that uh, meeting probably. And then, uh, we'll see what happens. Could be buying two aircraft carriers, though. And I'm waiting for the UN right now to vote, or to agree to vote at least. I don't think we've even done that yet on Lebanon. Oh, in the meantime, is that thing built? Yes, it is. All right, there's 100 soldiers there. It is time to begin to move other forces to that airbase. 50 fighters. Let's go ahead and move them. Thank you for taking care of the ecology. And let's go ahead and move another 43 fighters. There. Got helicopters there, we got a lot of units here. Plenty of tanks, 800, so we're gonna use probably these two tank columns. All of these commandos will go. You are giving our... All right, we already got a boost from him. Our fighters are moving, repositioning. I'm gonna go ahead and move the helicopters to that base too. I don't know if there's like a capacity logistical thing here or not, but uh... I like to just spread things out a little bit. All right, this should be safe. Coffee. Sure. Splendid country. And you're right. 
It is the most beautiful country in the world. We are on good terms. Next time, come and visit my summer residence. I'll ah. show you the countryside. Nice and nice invitation. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Can I buy gold? No. No gold. What else did I want to buy? I don't know if there's anything else I could buy. I could buy food. I don't have any food. I got food. Let's buy some food. Oh, their prices. Yeah. That's not a good price. Get out of here. Sugar. No, not really. Sheep. We got plenty of sheep. It's grease. I forgot. Um, software industry. Natural gas. Could get some natural gas from them. Just trying to get under my price, really. I'd like to give him a good price. Yeah, let's give him that price. Okay, cheaper than mine. Maybe that'll help improve relations. Uh, how about a non-aggression pack? I can't get any any type of agreements with anybody. Militarily was. Okay, that's it. Hopefully that'll. Do something. We're buying up natural gas. Hopefully, trying to sway some of these security council members. The other suggestion was to go ahead and give them aid. Um, let's do that. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and give a lot of these security council countries aid. Here we go. Let's give aid. Oh, our donation in billions. Billions. No way. I'm not giving a billion dollar aid. I'll say 10 million to each country. How about that? There we go. Average donation is 31. Okay, let's make it 41. That's better. Okay, 41 donation to Ghana. And Nigeria. Average donation is 25. We'll make it 30. Boom. Uh, Rwanda. No, 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 Good God. Rwanda. Give aid. 11. Let's give them 20. I'm losing track. I gotta be around 70, 80, 80 million dollars in aid being given out. Ajabazan. Can I zoom in? Yes. Okay, good. Azerbaijan, let's give them aid. 23, we'll give them 30. It's got to put me over 100 million in aid that I'm giving out right now. Confirm. I don't think Japan needs aid. Bhutan, I'll give you 10. I don't think the Russians need any aid, do they? They're not getting any aid. Iran. They're not. They're not going to support me on this because they back the uh, Lebanese and the Hezbollah. Wow, Iran on the Security Council. Wow. Okay. Hope they don't sway Russia or China. Nigeria seems neutral. Did we give them aid? Serbian network. Total Jihad terrorists. Proof that the Serbian government secretly finances total jihad terrorists which attack Myanmar. People are not going to like that one. That will be cause for war. I can't get any dirt. I have dirt on a lot of these Balkan countries. Bosnia, Herzegovina, Serbia, and Kosovo. But I can't get dirt on Macedonia. I think I have Montenegro too. So... I can't attack them either. Maybe I can go through Bulgaria. I guess I have a meeting request with Bulgaria for much later. We're gonna do this like in July, August, or something like that. Yeah. I hope I, re I, hope I remember that. 
Macedonian. See, Macedonian, I, I got nothing on Macedonian. I feel like I should integrate them some in a different way, maybe. Maybe if I can try, like, some sort of diplomatic route with Macedonia. Macedonia, Albania, Bulgaria, and Kosovo. Could I form, like, a regional group? A regional alliance with these guys. That would give me... Well, if I have Mont do I have Montenegro? If I had Montenegro... If I had dirt on Montenegro, then I could invade there. Consult files on heads of stage. We got Serbia, Kosovo, Bosnia and Herzegovina. Alright, no Montenegro. So. Emotion competes with pride when I look at this building. Before us stands the expression of our national genius. Yes, let us not mince words. This is a sacred fire which stimulates our architect's vision and drives the passion of our building professionals. Okay. All right. Uh, Prime Minister, my situation in the government is delicate. I'm thinking about running. I think I am running certain risks. Do you wish me to pursue with clandestine actions? Sure, go ahead. Um, what is going on with the UN? I have not heard from them. No pending resolutions. No agenda. No sanctions. Sure. Dark and strong, please. Very kind. All right. Aircraft carrier? Did somebody say aircraft carrier on this? There are no aircraft carriers. Okay. I don't think I'll get an aircraft carrier from them. <laughs> what about gold? Any gold? They probably don't have enough gold. Nope, not enough. Europeans never have enough gold. Alright, I didn't see any aircraft carrier, so I don't know what they're talking about with that. I guess I have to do the negotiations through that other window. Vote with me. I understand what you're saying, but... I still need some more time to make up my mind. Why haven't I had any news from this? I feel like I should have heard back from them now by now. Try that again. Oh, we already did it. We already did it. Why isn't it coming up on the... Uh... Alright. Mole unprotected. Do you wish me to pursue clandestine activities? No, we got enough dirt on them. Don't worry about it. Okay. UN Security Council, ah, here we go. The UN Security Council decided to proceed with your request for military intervention against Lebanon while proposing Resolution 2338. The resolution will be subject to vote in the next session. I wanted to point out that you still have the possibility of meeting with heads of state like current members of the Security Council. I already did all that. Did my aid have any effect? Not there. Where is this? No, that's not it. I don't know if my aid had a tremendous amount of effect. And meeting with these people does not seem to be going well. And we are coming up on about 30 minutes here. So, ah, one more meeting. One more meeting. Coffee for Trump. Sure. Dark and strong, please. Love your country. Egomaniac. Yes, he loves that. Okay, um, here we go. 
Aircraft carriers? I guess not. Nope. America has gold. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we're already on the contract. Where are we getting our gold from? I can't remember. I am losing track of things in this series. Okay. I don't think I need anything from Trump. We could buy more ships. We could buy more other weapons. Where's the aircraft carrier? There's no aircraft carrier. I can't believe that. Alright. It should be... I think we need helicopters. I don't think they'll get there in time. Drones would be good, too. Drones. We got drones. We could use more drones. Helicopters. There you are. 42. Give me... 20 helicopters. 16? Oh my god. Oh my god. Twenty one. Oh. Oh, I'm going to try that again. Because I do want helicopters. And I'd like to make a deal with the Americans just to secure their vote. Which should be pretty secured. What do we say? 20 helicopters here. And let's go for a price of 1584 27 We'll go up to 1630 They go down to 25 Let's go up to 1760 There we go. 23 18 Ah, come on. How many did I have? Four or five? Alright, try that again. Try that one more time and then I'm done. I should just do this. I should just end the episode and do this on my own, right? Probably. 20. Put the two in front of that. And it didn't work going l that low. It's better. Yeah, we get a better starting price. Okay, let's see if I can't. 24. I'm going to go 18, 36, 23. Try 1950. Let's try 20. Oh god. Let's see if they take that one. Okay, good. 20 helicopters. Quality three. Once off purchase from the United States. Four hundred and fifty-eight million dollars with interest over three years. Deal is done. Thank you, Ronald. You are my ally. Number one. You should back me on this. Okay, so I guess in the next episode... Oh, God. The contract you just signed wasn't stellar. That's the least I can say. Still, I can say that on its merits, it does serve our economy. You can find all of this on the small note from the department attached to the contract. I've never had that. <laughs> I have never heard that bad contract thing before. Okay, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, looks like we're over 30 minutes here. In the next episode, hopefully we'll get that UN Security Council vote passed. And then, war with Lebanon. Thank you for watching. See you in the next episode.